A young player at your position we haven't heard a whole lot about yet is Jalen Pickle. I think he's a richer freshman. What kind of where is he at in his development right now? He's developing well. I mean, you know, he, he redshirted last year. So he's coming off that first year redshirt of, of learning, you know, not so much the old scheme because, you know, that's not here anymore. But just how to play at this level and the speed coming out of, you know, a small town in, in Kansas and, and developing from, from that level to this level. So he's developing good. I mean, I, I'm excited to see um, his development. From a physical standpoint, he's probably not far off. He looks like pretty large for a redshirt freshman, I guess, not far off from you. For sure. I mean, he, he has the size, he has the length, and uh, that's that's what you see in the D lineman, you know, especially at three tech when they get out there and rush. Um, as long as he, you know, we get him uh, moving a little bit more and and not stiffened up, he's going to be he's going to be good. How would you describe Coach Tui's kind of coaching style? So since you've been with him, you know, probably seventy five percent of spring football right now. Very demanding, which I like that. You know, shows shows that he cares. Um, it's it's not a, a ground and pound like here and there yelling type type of uh, coach. But he, he like he gets to know you know he's getting to know our family. He's getting to know um, everything about us. Uh, in the film room, it's not football all the time, but it, but in in other words, I would say um, he was more of like a father figure, you know, caring about us in that type of way. How much, I guess, personal touch or involvement do you get from Coach Kleiman with your position group? A lot. I mean, we we I wouldn't even even I wouldn't even cut it down to a position group. I would. As a whole team, I mean, he's in every room, in every position group, on the field, talking to everybody. I mean, I wouldn't cut it down to who he's talking to more at all. It's just he's everywhere. Is there any offensive players do you feel like taking a big step this spring that can jump off the page to you that you like what you're seeing from them? Some offensive players. Mm -hmm. I like the running backs right now. You know, um, just with the old scheme compared to the new scheme, like how our running backs move and, and how they uh, make their cuts is exciting. I like I like how they're playing. Uh, Skyler's always always improving. That kid, he's always in the he's always in the playbook, you know. So I'm excited to see where he develops even more. What about any of the offensive linemen? You go up against them practice. Is there some that you say, well, he's you know way better than he was last year? Way better than he was last year. I would, if I was going to put somebody in that category, I'm going to put Adam Holtorf in that guy. I mean, that, personally, I go against him every day. I mean, he's probably one of the best O-linemen I've played against, you know, not just on our team, but in the league. Um, there are some good O-linemen in this league, but he's definitely one of the best, if not one of the better centers, centers in the nation.